apology. I didn't mean to put you in a tough spot. I didn't want to force you to lie. And, you know, you get to my age, I just tend to uh, dismiss my aches and pains. It's OK. You are going to go to the doctor, though, right? I'm going to get all the help I need. Good. Thank you. Don't worry. Goodbye, sweetheart. Thank you. Bye, Jessica. Better not give away too much of this stuff. It's precious. I'm not really in the mood for your jokes. I'm too busy being furious with Je you. Jessica. No, I knew something was off. And you made me doubt my own instincts. Headaches, blurred vision. Why wouldn't you tell me? Because I didn't have time to deal with it, and I didn't want you to worry. OK, well, you always have time to take care of your health. Well, what if it's something that can't be taken care of? Like what? CTE, no cure. So I don't see the point of being poked and prodded by doctors. I've been down that road before. Mm -mm. I'd rather just be present. I understand. I felt that way myself. But do you remember when I didn't want to call my oncologist because I didn't want bad news? And you told me that I couldn't live in fear? Well, now I need you to take your own advice. Go and see a doctor. Okay. 